Los Santos, a city that sometimes can be peaceful and other times can be a nightmare. In tonight's episode of Weasel News, we are going to be talking about robberies amongst the city and we are going to bring one in front to you, a robbery that happened at the Mirror Park LTD. Tune in now as we bring you that story here on Weasel News. Hello everybody, my name is Chris Gray here with Weasel News where right now it might be peaceful outside this LTD, but that wasn't the case. We're going to go to showing you what occurred here of a robbery at this LTD, as well as a interview with the hostage of the situation here on Weasel News. Hello everybody, this is Chris Gray. We are, we're outside the station here at Mirror Park uh, where we do have some type of a hostage situation going on. Uh, we do have local authorities here in K-9. Uh, it does look like we have a some type of maybe a worker. He has a vest on as a hostage. And is that a snowman as one of the suspects? It, it definitely looks like we got Frosty the Snowman here uh, in his get up here as one of the suspects. He does have a gun in his hand. I am not sure who is over here on the other side. It does look like we do have the hostage there and it does look like we do have a gun. Oh no, there's another there is another Frosty. Alright, so it looks like we got the Frosty gain here at Mirror Park. Uh, it looks like the Frosty game is coming out. Uh, I don't, I don't see a hostage though, so I don't know who their hostage is. Uh, unless that that gentleman there was their hostage, it looks like. Uh, two Frosty the Snowmans here robbing the gas station, the LTD here at Mirror Park. As you can see, uh, the everybody's getting in their cars and stuff. Uh, it looks like they did have that gentleman there as their hostage and as you can see the Frosties are taking off with the police in tow and as you can see here we do have the hostage Crazy. here's the hostage were you the hostage in the situation sir yes sir can you tell the people at home what it was like right so those two snowmen right one had a really big card and one had a really small card but I thought I reassured him that's like it's not about the size of the boat, you know, it's about the motion of the ocean, you know. And so you think that they might have been offended by the size of their carrots? Yes, I feel like they the the, the officers of the lower were profiling them about the carrots, the size of the carrots. Wait, and so like, the officers were sitting there assuming things off the size of their carrots? Yes, exactly. It is brutal, it is horrific, it is a horrendous. She was but he, here's she was she Here's was my question at the though. size of his carrot. Oh, yeah. Were they successful at getting the dough? Yes, they were successful at getting the dough. So, in other words, it doesn't matter what size the carrots are. They got the money and they ran. <laughs> exactly. But I feel like it was a bit crying when she, she laughed at his carrot. Like, you could see the tears in his eyes, you know? I feel ashamed that our city officials would sit there and make fun of somebody because of their carrot. I don't know, it is disgusting, isn't it? To think, we've got to live in this society of where our, the size of our carrots matter, you know? Well, Weasel News is going to make sure that the citizens know about this situation. That's good, that's good, you know? Off, people shouldn't laugh at the size of the carrots, you know? They definitely like, shouldn't. You know, it's, it's not their fault how they grow. It's like, you know... Was well, there anything you'd like to say to anybody that might be caught in a situation such as this? Um, well, I am running a charity uh, for situation for hostage situations. Uh, you can donate to me. Um, 
and you know, like, you can get a good, some good money. I get some, well, the people get some good money. You know, just, just please donate to me, to the charity, please. Money's tight out here, you know. Well, I mean, you know, maybe you don't have a big enough care. Yeah, maybe, maybe that, well, that is one of the reasons she laughed at me, but come on, what can you do at the end of the day? You know? <laughs> exactly. But thank you so much for your time. We definitely appreciate it here at Weasel News. Yes, sir. Thank you for watching at home. This is Chris Gray with Weasel News here at Mirror Park. As you can see, the hostage was okay in an instance here at the LTD. Uh, there might have been uh, some shaming going on. I'm not sure if the law enforcement would like that information to be out, but I guess there was some shaming on sizes of carrots. Now, the suspects of this incident did not get captured and was still at large after this incident occurred. Thank you for tuning in to Weasel News. My name is Chris Gray and have a wonderful day.